Okay guys, today we'll be cleaning this 50cc carburetor. Same setup for all four stroke carburetors. So what you need, you need some carb spray, you need a Phillips screwdriver, a ratchet, flat edge screwdriver, and a number seven millimeter socket. So let's dive into it. First you want to remove these three screws at the bottom of the carb. Make sure the screwdriver fits in there properly so you don't strip them out. You don't want to strip these bolts out. You just remove these three screws. You don't need to remove these two. This is, this is for your accelerator pump. We're just cleaning the car today. Taking out the jets and cleaning them. Just through the rubber spacer. All right, so this is your carburetor. This is your float. This is your main and pilot jet, and this is your idler jet. So we need to remove these. This is two. Make a note. This is two different jets. So what you need to do, you actually need to get an eight millimeter to hold on to this jet, and then to take the main jet out. So yeah, you're gonna need an eight millimeter over inch policy. Seven millimeter over inch. Okay guys, so if you don't got a seven millimeter open wrench, you can just use needle nose pliers, just to snug that, get it hold hold it in. And you use your flathead, take out your main jet. And we use our seven millimeter open wrench. Here, my deep socket. Take out the pilot jet. That over there. And we use our flathead to get out our starter jet. Our idler jet. And then now what you do, you can look through the top of the jet to see if you can see completely through there. And the side orifices, you can see if there's any crud or any dirt in there. So you just get your carb spray, give it a shot or two. Don't let this stuff get in your eyes, guys. So you just want to spray some carb spray through all of them, make sure Yes, it's coming through all the holes and passages. And then lastly, we spray on our main jet. And that's that. So now you can just start putting stuff back together. And basically, this is for any four stroke carburetor. You can clean any four stroke carburetor just like that. Just when you're tightening down, you don't want to over tighten, you just want to get it snug to where it's just tight enough. Do not over tight. All right, so you just get back your jets in where you took them out, tighten them back down, snug, and then 
last three are main jet. And that's how you clean your four stroke carburetors. It's not a hassle. Alright. So you just put back everything together and that's it guys. Remember, please like, share, and subscribe. And feel free to comment below. Your comments are always appreciated.